Hi, we're Bros Grim Punk. Yeah, Howard, I'm calling from Phoenix. Um, I just wanted to give you guys a kid's perspective. I got a nine-year-old sister that just called me and asked me, why do people hate the Americans? Well, because we have everything, and we have a way of life that's organized and yeah. free, and they're oh, jealous. Sorry. I mean, it's an easy question to answer. Yeah. We have it all. Says, Honey, I'm sorry you have to list stuff like this. Because these other countries live in fear of their leaders. It's unbelievable. They're raised to hate. And we have to now recognize. I believe in murder. I believe in pain, I believe in cruelty and infidelity, I believe in slime. Drop, let me drop in, dog.
Howdy, punkers. It's Brother Drum Punkcast. It's been brutal lately, man. Uh, getting into the second week of September 2024. Like every year, we start the show out to remember 9 11. You know, never forget. I always play that in there because, you know, Mr. Stearns, he, t- he you know, we kind of took a wild stance here and there. A lot of good music keeps coming out. Started a show with brand new The Slime from Toronto. That's a title track, Crab Walk, off of their upcoming new album, Crab Walk to the Oblivion. It doesn't tell us when the new Crab Walk to Oblivion album is coming out. Go get that single over Bandcamp from The Slime. Great, guys. Good stuff to start the show. Can't wait to hear it full length. Yeah, that first set kind of ripped your face off. Uh, the next one, Svalter from Indonesia did Raw Noise Ungovernable off of the arsenal of mindfuck. We gotta love that raw distortion in there. Society Sickos after that from Portland. Ended it with a couple Portland bands. Society Sickos did Crypt Creep off a new four track demo and one of the BGP house bands, Carnicum. Luke from Carnicum put together a band. He's been playing shows. That was a brand new one from him. Set Bone, a band camp single, brand new. Rocket Sled in the background, weird stuff. Our friend of the show, Saddam Bin Laden, bought the new EP over on our Bandcamp page, Cricket's EP. That's awesome. He's got a good one coming up right here. USA Bombs. This is another 2024 single. You can find it on YouTube. This is USA Bombs. Old Kamala has it in the bag. No no need to you know, get worried, get worked up. Don't get yourself worked up. Because you're brainwashed if you're going for either one of these red or blue. Here we go from Inland Empire down in Southern California, Saddam Bin Laden with USA Bombs. Luke from Carney Come, and y'all are listening to the Brothers Grimm Punkcast. I love punk music on the World Wide Web. AOL keyword come. Skate fast, eat ass.
This whole thing about the border, we've been to the border. We've been to the border. You haven't been to the border. I, and I haven't been to Europe. And I, I mean, I don't, I don't understand the point that you're making. I'm not just...
But look, I think that this president in particular is going to appeal a lot more uh, to the youth generation because something about him feels very uh, punk rock and rebellious. He's a rebellious president. He's rebelling against the establishment. He's rebelling against the mainstream media.
getting close to the elections, mayhem out there. That was all brand new stuff. We laid old Uncle Pat to rest last Friday. Of course, it was band camp Friday, so the bad acts and I, we weren't at all anywhere remotely in a position to support all the bands on band camp Friday. Whatever, we didn't do our part. Some people brought uh, a couple singles though over on our band camp page. Uh, I don't know, understand why people just don't buy the whole album for that much because you can download it for free. Everything on our Bandcamp page, Brothers Grim Punk Bandcamp page. But hey, love the support regardless. And then next Bandcamp Friday, I'm sure I'll have some, oh, I was doing this or that. You know how it goes over here. Yep, yeah, it's just mayhem in California, you know, as usual. Gas prices, like 5.20 a gallon, something crazy. Bread, hamburger. Why is it always hamburger? There's like four grades of hamburger, and they're always like the price of hamburger. Not that many people out there living off of hamburger. You have war in the background. War in the background. Exit mold. You just heard some fuzz punk right there from Australia. That was Jackhammer off their new EP, Fervor Mortal. Before that, did Frustration off of their new demo from Education Seneca brand new one from them before that parliament ruins from uk did fairy tale death off of piss take nothing to harvest records before that falsos positivos did kill fascist kill off their new false negative split hate mile before that that was a painter's tape michigan release they did low art off of spread the love snit fit before that from newfoundland that's always a tricky one to say newfoundland they did their title track, Snit Fit, off of their demo, World Corpse, before that, from UK, did Neurotic Hate Fiends, off of Life After Work, New, New Seeing Red, before that, it's always hard to tell if it's a re-release from Seeing Red or actual new stuff, but that was Guden Regal, maybe I should have translated that, I'd get over their Bandcamp page, they got so much music on there, that's off there, No Way Split, and Saddam Bin Laden, started it out thanks for your support next up let's do designated monsters unit this is two from them starting with confusions prince doing hardhead off of their new self-titled Keep talking! 
Thanks for tuning in to the Brothers Grimm Punk Cast. Without your support, we would sound like this. close with what I've long said. America is a nation that can be defined in a single word. I was in the, foothill, uh, foot, foot, excuse me, in the foothills of the Himalayas with 
Xi Jinping, traveling with him. I guess we traveled 17,000 miles when I was vice president. I don't know that for a fact. you call it a bad attitude you know i was kind of a punk you know i said i'll let you have me on your show i was real the worst way to try to get a job The only reason can be a good. A boy can 
Let's have a look at the pantry. Oh, here we go. Half a cold hot dog. Um, you, you don't have a vegetarian option, do you? So, you don't believe in uh, violence or eating meat? I don't like uh, contributing to the, the suffering in the world, I guess. Well, that's a great philosophy, man, but most people in the world, they just eat whatever they can get. And it's one thing to say you can't face violence, but when it faces you, you better be ready. ourselves over here big gold piss that was big gold piss you heard from what 2023 get that over on our band camp as well remember go over to brothers grim that's where you need to go anything brothers grim punkcast related that you need to know every link right there threw in some random stuff in there that was the bgp you just heard ancient filth before that with earth brains from earth brains flexi Close combat before that, 2019. That was I drew the skinhead for you, 2019. The exploited before that, mucky pup, awful punk's not dead, of course. Meat wagon before that did let's get ripped off of the arrival. All pretty new ones before that with a couple off a new comp I found delinquents and shit bags from a knuckles on stun records from Tennessee. That was Shitbots did Wildman and Big Bopper before that did my movie. 
Temporary Curse from Ghost Space Records, Texas before that, with a time to spare off of a beep thrash, and to, to start out from Designated Monsters Unit, Who to Blame did Agnostic Front off of their demo and Confusions Prince, one off their self-titled started out. One more set, yes, yeah, Sonic Warhead in the background. Here is Payload of Atomic Warhead Nightmares. They're going to do feed power control off of the summer 2014 tape. And I've heard this over at Punk Rock Jukebox and something happened. Monsters, just his YouTube channel just disappeared from the face of their flat earth. Fell off the edge of the flat earth into the oblivion. And I think he came back as monster or something. But I haven't seen a live show in the past couple weeks. So hopefully the Punk Rock Jukebox didn't go away. Here is Payload of Atomic Warhead Nightmares. I 
kind of examination because people have got to know whether or not their president is a crook. Well, I'm not a crook. I've earned everything I've got.
Go get our Crickets EP over on our Bandcamp page. Go do it. Oh, I was putting together the show, wrapping up the final edits, and Mad Axe sent me a link to brand new Vista Blue. So we are cooling it down and closing it out over here on the BGP like usual with some brand new Vista Blue. Perfect for the times. I mean, come on, pop punk every now and then, right, everybody? Vista Blue from Tennessee with Nobody Told Me It Was Bandcamp Friday. Brand new off of a little two song release. Vista Blue are the Pop Punk Preservation Society. Good shit. Go over to Bandcamp. Check out Vista Blue. The After Darks before that with No Good off of Rock and Roll is Dead. A little mixture of stuff too in there. Epis Taxis before that with Get Bent. That's from Cross Contamination, Florida, I believe, off their demo. Half Life before that from San Luis Obispo did Under the Knife from all our yesterdays my mic is now recording i must have hit it some kind of setting because the mic is recording way differently than it normally does <laughs> oh well real enemy before that from pittsburgh did stop the lies off of life with the enemy overthrow from berlin did hunter of the universe off of their overthrow ep tape distemper before that i hate people off their self-titled tokyo lungs from UK before that did Put Me Down off their self-titled EP. Doji before that did Satan is Good But You're an Asshole off of Forced Climax EP and Payload of Atomic Warhead Nightmare started out. A little a few a few punk rock jukebox songs in there in that set. Brigada Bastarda in the background. We're gonna cool down and close it out with one from Popular Fiction Los Angeles. This is Guilt. And they're going to do properly fitting for this show, and that has been lately. They're going to do Dirt Nap off of I Will Commit a Holy Crime. And, you know, don't be wimp out there, punkers. Uh, keep doing the right thing. It's us against the world. Long live punk. Yeah. Keep the haters in the 